Well, welcome back, everyone. We're very excited to have a couple of guests here to tell us about a new event that's coming to Bangor pretty soon, and a lot of people are getting excited about it. We will soon be having our first Bangor Marathon and a Half, I think they're calling it. Yep. And we have Laura and Gavin joining us this morning to tell us all about it. Um, this thing's going to take place in June. First of all, thanks for being here this morning. You're welcome. This is going to take place in June, and yep. this is going to be big for the city. This is. This is. Maine has a really rich running uh, history. I mean, we have we have a main running Hall of Fame. We have you know um, Bob Booker. We have uh, Joan uh, Benoit, Benoit Samuelson. Samuelson yeah. You know Robin Emery. So there's so much rich history, and Bangor has not had a major race in a long time. So we want to bring back not only a marathon to Bangor that's going to be Boston certified, it's USATF sanctioned, but also something that we where this city can shine. It's in a renaissance. It needs a marathon. And it takes a lot of people, a lot of organizations to do that. Who's putting this on? Yeah, I know you've got some good sponsors now, too. Yes, we do. Um, our, uh, David and I, my husband, we have a company called Lifestyle Sports Global, mm -hmm. and we're organizing it. And we have our title sponsor here today, which is Bangor Savings Bank. And Gavin has something to tell about that. Why is Bangor Savings Bank getting involved on in all this? Well, thanks for asking. Uh, Bangor Savings Bank likes to partner with organizations that can really help raise the economy and create a more vibrant community. Mm -hmm. And uh, throwing a marathon like this and a half marathon is going to attract people to the community and we're really excited to partner with this uh, event. They've uh, seen that up in Millinocket. They created their yes. marathon there and now it's turned into this huge thing every year. Yep. Yes, yep. 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 Hopefully we'll do that here too. Well, we will, yeah. we will. And we're looking for community involvement. There's many ways you can be a sponsor but we also need volunteers to make the mm -hmm. course safe. And that's being at locations where traffic and runners may be. Sure. There's also an opportunity for car dealerships to come on and be mobile support vehicles. Mm -hmm. They'd have water Gatorade and cheerleaders in there to cheer those runners on and make sure everybody's safe on the course. It does um, take a lot of people, a lot of moving parts in this kind of thing. We, we don't have a lot of time today, but if people are interested, yes. if they want to learn more or, or take part, where do they go? So you can go to our website, Lifestyle Sports Global, the, or on Facebook, you can go to the Great Bangor Marathon, and that's our. We can get our contact information there, and we will be posting things out there like prize money. It's coming up. Big Pri announcement prize this money week. too. Yes, that's not a bad yes. thing. Yeah, it's okay. Great. Do you have a Facebook page or anything like that? We do. It's called okay. the Great Bangor Marathon in Half. Okay. Yep. All right. And then our website is lifestylesportsglobal.com. Okay. Well, we will keep in touch with you guys over the weeks leading up to this thing. It's on what June June twenty third. So mark your calendars for that. Uh, we'll have to have you back. You have another thing you want to say? I do. Back? I want to say we will see you all at the starting line. Uh, there you go. <laughs> all right. Thanks for joining us this morning. We'll Thank see you, you soon. Uh, let's send it back over to Devin for a look at that forecast. Thank you.